So uh, I just wanted to make this quick video because this is a topic that just struck me right on the head. And while I have it in my mind, I want to explain my thoughts or express my thoughts on it. Um, and basically what I find is a lot of people searching for the perfect dieting foods or foods to stick to to improve their overall health or goals and fitness and reaching how, and how they can improve uh, their the route to their fitness goals, how they can uh, approach them optimally. Um, with that said, uh, what you would find in what the research clearly tells us is um, that all the foods that improve our our way of life um, are what we have relied on way back when our hunter-gatherer ancestors were, were basically killing and searching to survive. Um, they, they basically relied on uh, the, the nutrient sources that were um, that came from the ground and when they found, found um, the kill uh, they, they ate until they were satisfied and then they survived the rest of the night until they found more food but um, this practically makes a ton of sense um, lean meats um, vegetables with fiber to uh, aid in optimal brain health uh, mobility those are the foods that we would naturally stick to so um, dairy we would that that eventually grew um, low-fat dairy products are are incredibly essential to overall human um, existence but um, meats uh, provide proteins that are, that we essentially need to uh, grow in 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 repair our our, our system but um, that there are foods that, that are better than others but you don't have to strictly um, stick to completely organic foods or the best supplements out there because you can improve your overall health just by um, providing some of these nutrients that are essential to our overall well-being um, into your diet on a regular basis so j just by shopping at the grocery store um, there, there are really essential micro and macronutrients in lean proteins like steak, um, low-fat ground beef, and chicken, all that. Basically, you can you can improve your mind and body by um, keeping two things in your diet. Um, which is an essential amino acid, or two essential amino acids that are found in the proteins that we can eat and in some of the vegetables that we can grab at the grocery store. Um, and that would be uh, tryptophan and tyrosine. Um, they're essentially found in really lean meats. So if you buy the foods that we would um, normally have for survival, uh, way back then, then that that's all you need to improve your overall functions as a human being. Um, so what I what I typically shop for is chicken breast, um, lean cuts of steak, the leanest ground beef that you can find because you can eat more of it, and uh, tryptophan actually aids in preventing depression and tyrosine releases uh, dopamine which may make you feel really good so um, yeah in carbohydrates the sources that you can get um, from veggies the certain nutrients that are in veggies um, actually aid in the release of, of a neurotransmitter called serotonin and if you know anything about endorphins uh, they just make you feel really good and serotonin uh, makes you feel relaxed and gives you a, a sense of of uh, completedness. So, if you were to have 
uh, carbs later on in the day, uh, it would essentially make you feel really good and tired. Um, that's why I do intermittent fasting as a, as a uh, as an aid in um, how my body optimally, optimally performs throughout the day. But um, there's there's tons of information and. I, I just feel that intermittent fasting fits so perfectly well with how our, our bodies naturally would have worked way back then. So um, if you want to learn more about that, my site's there, but uh, I just wanted to throw this topic out there because uh, I feel that there's a lot of people that struggle with uh, improving their overall health and uh, the route to their success in fitness. Uh, so. I hope you guys like this video and have an excellent day.